Hi, today we'll take a look on a very popular Nginx alias traversal vulnerability, which allows anyone to read files outside current directory. As you can see I'm running Jinx version 1.10.3. So, let's dive into it. I've set the image path outside of the web root directory as C, images so we can access any file within the images directory. Let me show you nginxweb.config file. Here it is. As you can see I've tested so many different configurations just to test this vulnerability. Let's close the terminal windows first. Head over to the attribute named server. There we will find the alias I've defined. The proper way to define an alias or path is by adding a location attribute followed by our alias and the opening and closing curly brackets and inside those braces. We can add path to any directory next to the alias keyword. Now let's head back to browser. And on the other tab, we can try payload in the URL bar. But first, you guys might be thinking that what's the root cause of this vulnerability? Suppose this is our URL. So according to the rule, nginx will match it. And appends the remainder to the destination, which will result in this value as path. So now we discovered the reason behind its misconfiguration. Let's exploit it. Clear it. I've created a file in my C drive outside the images directory named flag.txt. We will now try to access it. Here we go. We got the contents of flag.txt file. We can also test this vulnerability using curl request. Let's try it. Type curl and paste URL we copied earlier from address bar. And we got the same response. Well now as we have successfully exploited it, we should now check the C drive for directory structure and the flag file. This is the flag.txt file. Let's take a look at its contents. It's the same file which means our payload worked. Close it now. So here is the images directory. And this is the image we used on our index page. This file is for testing. Let's do it now. Copy the file name. And paste it here. Oops. Either we can remove the payload or add 4 slash images. Yup. Finally, we got the response. And please don't forget to subscribe.